domestic oil crude supply. Lokmobiri gives parties five days to resolve all issues. This is a very serious matter. So guys, let's quickly take the details of the report. Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Heniken Lopobiri has asked and tasked a newly formed committee with resolving domestic crude supply challenges within five days. This directive follows discussions addressing misunderstanding regarding the domestic crude oil supply obligations among international and indigenous oil companies. Speaking during a meeting with representatives from the oil producers trade section and the independent petroleum producers group in Abuja on Thursday, Lokmobiri emphasized the government's commitment to local refining and fostering a competitive business environment in the oil sector. He said that the meeting reached some agreement on the operationality of domestic crude oil supply obligations except for a few gray areas and that at the end of the day they have been able to agree except one or two gray areas and so what they have resolved is that there should be a small committee headed by the permanent secretary that will look at the matter between Monday to Tuesday and further give back reports. Giving a background to the meeting, the minister said there seems to be some misunderstanding of a regulation made by National Union of Petroleum Resources Corporation that has to do with domestic crude oil supply obligations by oil companies and as part of their policies here in the ministry whenever they see that there is a seeming misunderstanding they bring parties together with a view to building conscience and consensus resolving whatever misunderstanding that parties may have. He then expressed optimism about reaching a consensus on outstanding issues, reiterating that all stakeholders are dedicated to fulfilling their obligations under the Petroleum Industry Act. Recall that Dangote Refinery and other indigenous refiners have raised concerns about the lack of domestic crude oil supply. The IPPG, an association of Nigeria indigenous upstream explorations and production companies, had earlier called on President Bola Hamed Tinibu to consider declaring a state of emergency on crude oil production in Nigeria due to the ongoing issues. The Nigerian Upstream Petroleum Regulatory Commission has also taking steps to enforce the domestic crude oil supply obligations as outlined in the Petroleum 
Industry Act 2021. The Commission Chief Executive Engineer Benga Komo Lafe had earlier directed the Enforcement Committee to develop a template for the seamless implementations of the domestic crude oil supply obligations within 48 hours as Nigeria's grapples raising oil production. The meeting between Lopodiri OPTs and IPPG is crucial in finding solutions to the challenges facing the industry and ensuring adequate crude oil supply to domestic refineries. It is true this issue regarding domestic crude oil supply obligation is not to the matter. These are issues caused by greedy politicians, greedy military officers, pretending to be guiding the process, the oil pipe and oil refineries, only forbid to be the one are the ones tapping and producing illegal crude oil and petrol. And it is very obvious that all these illegal processes are being backed up by some politicians or senior military navy officers or militaries to ensure that this process continue and no one will fall victims. So why complaining? The whole way the issue of domestic crude oil supply can be stopped in Nigeria is for the federal government through the National Assembly to come up and enact a law of very serious penalty against those offenders. And it must start from the top leadership of Nigeria. Because these Nigerian leaders, they know what is involved. So guys, what are your thoughts on this? Kindly share your thoughts on the comment section below. And do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to Bliss Channel. Thank you.